In the face of rising grocery costs, parents are getting creative, finding ways to stretch their budget to make every dollar count. Kega 9's Jacqueline Aguilar is on the south side with a mom who's using her green thumb to make ends meet. Ashley Aldmeyer is no stranger to gardening and she puts her skills to use right here at her community garden to not only feed her family of three, but as well as all of her neighbors. Aldmeyer sourced free seeds from a local library to start her garden. It started with a few plants for my family. It was just like a pineapple and a tomato plant and a pepper plant. When she's not caring for her son, Altmeyer is tending to her garden. Growing produce is about trial and error, but Altmeyer assures it's not an impossible task when your goal is to save money. Now we've got five tomatoes plants. We've got three pepper plants. Uh, we've got zucchinis and squash and um, bean stalks and broccoli. Altmeyer was spending about $300 on groceries before starting her community garden. Now it's about $75. The produce was the most expensive thing that we were buying. So getting the, the produce out of our grocery budget gave us a lot more wiggle room with providing proteins and snacks and things that my son needs. In growing her produce and with help from the food bank, Altmeyer's personal pantry is now overflowing. She curbs food waste every day by welcoming her neighbors to Ashley's arrangements. Inside the pantry, anybody can help themselves to anything that's in there at any point in time. It's all free. There's eggs, there's produce, there's dried goods, there's proteins. You could feed a family of 20 off of what's in this box at any point in time for free. Borderlands Produce Rescue is hosting a powwow in April where you can get up to 70 pounds of produce for about $15. Details will be on kega9.com. Reporting in the south side on Valencia and 12th Avenue, Jacqueline Aguilar, Kega 9.